It has been two years since Georgia's first confirmed case of COVID-19. Now the state is recovering from the biggest surge of cases in the entire pandemic. Caitlin Heck breaks down where the numbers currently stand and how those numbers are trending. COVID-19 cases seem to be falling almost as quickly as they rose during the Omicron variant surge. So let's take a look at the COVID-19 case curve. Right before the state's two week preliminary data window, Georgia averaged 1065 new cases a day. We haven't seen numbers that low since November. Back in early January, the state reached a peak of more than 23,000. In late November, before the surge, Georgia averaged less than 850 new cases a day. The death toll from the virus also continues to fall. In late February, before the preliminary window, an average of 32 Georgians died a day. That's less than half the daily death toll in late January when the state averaged 80. Before numbers started climbing, though, Georgia averaged just 11 deaths a day in mid-December. Hospitals continue seeing relief. The state averages 113 new COVID-19 patients a day. Numbers have been steadily falling since mid-January when the state admitted more than 300 patients a day. The last time the hospitalization rate dipped below 100 was in early December. Our central Georgia counties are also seeing falling case numbers. I'll break down those coming up at 6. For now, I'm Caitlin Heck, 13 WMAC News.